This is easily the most incredible camp that we've ever taken our cabin to. We are right on the ridge line. It drops off right down there and then the mountains just sprawled out in front of us. It's absolutely incredible. Wow. This is gonna be a really relaxing couple of days. Uh, we're not gonna climb any peaks or do anything crazy on this one. We're more so just gonna enjoy cabin life here in the mountains. My wife Riley and our baby girl Olivia are staying with one of her best friends in Salt Lake City. And that's giving me a little bit of time to come up here into the mountains and get some solitude. Really just kind of refill the tank a little bit. <laughs> Got a few rain clouds that are coming through right now. It's incredibly relaxing. turned into a nice little storm here. You can hear those like long and drawn out thunder rolls. They're kind of spooky up here. So you can see how it goes from like a mixture of clouds over there to just solid rain and storm over here. Let's head in for now and uh, see if this passes in a little bit. If not, you know, maybe we'll still take the, take the truck out and do a little exploring. Might be kind of fun with the rain, honestly. I'm telling you though, there's nothing quite like taking in a storm. storm stopped so I figure this would be a good time to head out and explore some of these trails over here looks like we can drive up to that summit up there might as well right
Well guys, it is dinner time. I'm actually whipping up something healthy for once. <laughs> I eat healthy at home. When I'm out here, I, I usually end up eating cabin food. But tonight is gonna be different. I'm going to be making some chicken uh, over rice with a few veggies sprinkled in there and nice hearty meal to uh, kick off the evening. So I've got this lemon peppercorn chicken and uh, I think it's gonna be really, really good. I still can't get over the fact that this is our view right now. And it's not so bad out this side either. All right, so now we're gonna switch these out. Thank you for an incredible day. Amen. This looks amazing. Let's try the chicken first here. Mmm. So good. This is really hitting the spot. up to. Holy moly. Just a glorious day. Weather could not be better. It's not too hot, not too cold. It feels perfect. Check out all the sheep. How's everyone doing this morning? That is seriously so cool. <laughs> I've seen cows, you know, roaming areas like this. I've never seen sheep doing it before. So we're climbing this hill now, and it's got a real steep drop off. <laughs> Wow. 
Oh man, that was cool. been a really nice relaxing trip. I think a lot of the time when I'm out in places like this I feel like I have to just do as much as possible but sometimes I think just being in nature is enough you know like you don't have to climb anything you don't have to paddle you don't have to bike you can just sort of sit and appreciate it. So I've had another set of these solar lights for a while now. I put a couple of them up on our cabin up north in Minnesota. I figure why not put the last set up on the travel cabin. Sweet. Oh, these are gonna look so good at night. Do you hear those cows, by the way? They're going nuts. They sound like dinosaurs. So tonight we're making something uh, a little less healthy. I'm making some nachos. So the way that I make nachos on a stovetop like this is by layering the chips, meat, and our veggies, and then covering this pot and cooking it at a very low heat, essentially trying to mimic an oven. All right, let's take a look. Oh yeah. Just perfect. And because uh, Riley's not here, I'm going to be eating in bed and watching TV. <laughs> Excuse me, has anyone seen a toy car around here? Ooh, it's a baby. I make beautiful. Mmm. Wow. So good. Cheers to an absolutely amazing couple of days at one of the most incredible campsites that I've ever been to in my life. You know, as much as I do enjoy getting away, um, 
I miss my girls. <laughs> All three of them, actually. Uh, Ellie's back at home. Um, and uh, thankfully tomorrow I get to pick up Rye and Olivia. And we're headed to another awesome destination. So I'll see you guys in the morning. this adventure thank you so much for coming along how incredible is it to be up here at 10,000 feet on the edge of this ridge looking out over these beautiful mountains it's just surreal I want to thank all of you for watching and send a special thank you to our patrons uh, your support means the world and uh, stay tuned for next week we're headed to Nevada to Great Basin National Park it's such a beautiful place something you would not expect to see in Nevada, so make sure to come back for that. But it's time for me to go pick up the girls. See you next time.